First thing we need to do is take out these two fixing screws that are holding the back of the case on the door. Once these two fixing screws are removed, we can push our case forward and the case easily comes off the door. Once we've taken the case off the back of the door, we need to remove these two fixing screws which are holding the rim cylinder in the front of the door. Once we've taken the two fixing screws out, we can push the back of the cylinder and it pops out the front easily. The next thing we need to do is cut the tail on our new cylinder to the same length as our old cylinder. There's a few ways we can cut this. I just prefer to use two pairs of pliers. Once we've cut our tail piece down to length, we can replace the cylinder back into the door and then we need to replace these two screws that are holding the cylinder. Once we've replaced our two screws, we can get our case, pop that back on the door and replace the two fixing screws there. Once we've replaced the back case, we can take our new set of keys, make sure it's working perfectly.